Hey y'all, it's me James, and today I'm just going to do my shave of the evening, shave of the day. And for the shave, I saw someone else use it, can't remember who it was, uh, it was either yesterday or today. Um, but a soap that I like, Bear Stir Man, Trey Cheetah, First Snow. So, I'm going to use the First Snow today, it comes in a nice fancy glass container. Uh, one of the few like rare soaps that came out uh, that came out fancy so kind of like it for that aspect um, it's a really light mentholated type scent not overwhelming um, just kind of remind you of like a first snow and I thought well you know Spring is here officially in our area. Still get some cold nights and chilly mornings, but um, overall the days have been warming up quite nicely. So, just to say goodbye to winter and love the fact that we had some real snow this year, so that's why. Um, for the razor, first snow. Edelweiss white. So this is in the bone scales. Boker. Or as the stallion says, Boca. Just a lovely looking razor. And my TGN Superfine 2 band that I put in an old handle that needed a new knot because the old knot was just falling apart. Um, so that's what I'll be using. Beautiful brush, very dense. So, all right, so I'm gonna wash up, get ready and I'll be back, thanks. All right, I'm back. On my part, there was a delay I grabbed some towels that I was going to use as far as for holding up to my face and warming up the whiskers and <clears throat> pardon me, hydrating. And didn't know exactly where this batch of towels came from. Come to find out they're brand new because as I was warming up the towels, I could see the dyes going out. So just to be wary, if you grab towels that you're unsure about, even though they look clean, just be careful. Uh, you don't want any dyes and stuff going in your skin, possibly irritate you. Um, so anyway, those will have to had to wring them out, hang them up to dry, and then I'm gonna throw them in the water here or in the washer here a little bit later. Um, one other thing, as far as for aftershave, after the shave I'll be using Crampert's Finest 80 Below, which was a limited edition run. And this one is 18 out of 20. So, got that. If you guys haven't tried Crampert's Finest, uh, any of his aftershaves, great stuff. And going along with the Snow White theme, I'll be drinking a Samuel Adams Cold Snap white ale unfiltered look at that beautiful oh, oh yeah I love it love it love it uh, Vison's unfiltered white ales F at Vison's just great stuff oh man I wish they made this one year round All right, this brush has been soaking. Shook it out, squeezed it out. Take Le Bloom Water, pour it into my cup. 
leave just a little bit on top there. And away we go. Got to be careful and hold this one like that. Don't want this glass dropping anywhere. And this is slick soap. It's the only downfall to the uh, glass porcelain containers is when you have a nice thick glass, it's heavier like this one is but the soap gets quite slick you just gotta be careful gotta beat it alright get some water on the tips the old blue water come back to the soap that's where we're at right now one more run, just the tips, back at it. All right, nice and coated. Creamy proto leather, again, holding it underneath, just in case I tried to slip. <laughs> oh! cheeks be right back grab this proto leather to me it smells like it's got a bit of spice to it Reminds me of being among the evergreens in the Rockies. All right. Wipe this jar off real quick. It's not slipping and sliding everywhere. Don't want that. It's already slippery. Mental note. All right. Towel set up again. And here we go. It's already no right away. I'm gonna need some water. Go. Got a couple of days growth. Look at that. We go look at that creamy goodness. Water. And here we go.
Well, hi. Mm -hmm. What you doing? Just came by to visit. Oh, want to say hi. Hello. They can't see you. Hello. <laughs> Thank you. That was my son. Probably looked bigger than me because I was hunched into the mirror and he's like that, right? He's not bigger than me yet. Should say taller, I'm bigger than him. Weight wise. So Baby girl's returning from Poland tomorrow, and I've been, uh, she posted her journal today of her trip. Just really cool. Enjoyed it. There's that mirror in the way again. Just a huge blessing that she got to be selected for this trip. No money out of our pockets. It was all paid for. So, you know, God does things for us. And that's just an amazing thing be so young and be able to do something like that. Looks like she's had a wonderful host family out there too. So that's always nice. But <clears throat> yesterday, I mean, this is how nice the host family's been. Um, out of their own time, because this wasn't part of the uh, the group that she went with, this was out of the family's kindness, generosity. They drove from Warsaw to uh, the big famous castle that's about four hours away south of Warsaw. And it's kind of like everything is in a triangle. So let's say Warsaw's here up the top. And you go southeast to this castle. And then you would go westerly from there. And then this is about four hours back to Warsaw from there. So like that, you know. And so as they you know, they had this day yesterday of being able to go to Auschwitz. That's the other place they went to, or Auschwitz. And, uh, you know, just reading her journal entry about that, uh, you know, I could feel the emotion in her voice in the paper or in the typing. I mean, you just don't know how serious things like that are until you get to experience them firsthand, you know? And, uh, yeah, so she got to be a witness to that part. Because everything else on the trip has been, um, you know, nowhere near as much as that.
But she got to see uh, a lot around Warsaw as well, you know. But anyway, back to the family. And that just shows how generous they've been with her, uh, taking her time out of their day. Uh, she said the dad of this host family drove 12 hours total time yesterday. Wow. I mean, that's just amazing. Soap's drying up a little bit. That opportunity, I hope she will always have that special memory in her heart. And that she gets to do more, you know, that it'll make her on her own. Just curious to save money. Uh, perhaps find the job that can take her around the world to experiences from other places. She's very blessed, and so are we. go with that for pass one. It wasn't the prettiest, but effective. So, uh, yeah, I'm going to go ahead and finish up the rest of my shave and then I'll be back at the end. Thanks. All right, so I finished up my shave, cleaned up a little bit. Uh, again, tonight's shave was with the Boker Ada Vice. TGN Superfine 2 Band. Hmm. Barrister and Man Trey Cheetah for Snow. Now to close it off with some Crampert's Finest Limited Edition 80 Below. I also trimmed up my neck a little bit with the Edelweiss. Um, one thing, kind of uh, got the courage to do it because I've done it with a Feather Artist Club before. And I've actually nicked myself on my neck with the Feather Artist Club. Uh, so, I figured, well, if I'm not reluctant to use the Feather Artist Club, then uh, why not just go ahead and use a straight straight, the one that I know I can handle. And the reason why is because the Feather Artist Club will get you if you're, you know, there's no quarter there. It'll, you come in a little too much on one of those jokers and you will have blood. But a traditional straight uh, won't get you quite as crazy. So you just come in with a little bit, just like if you're going against the grain or something, you know, lay that blade flat and just kind of go up. I'm not going to get a BBS on my neck, it's just to clean off the hair there, you know. Thankfully I'm not a bear either, so it's not like it's really heavy growth, it's more than like long peach fuzz when it gets longer. So, good. Some cold snap. <sighs> All right, everyone. Uh, thank you for watching this Palm Sunday, 2015, and uh, this special time of remembering what that means, uh, especially for me. Uh, just hope you guys have a blessed week, and if I don't see you till next Sunday, have a blessed Easter with your loved ones. All right, everyone. Thanks. Have a good night. Bye.